represent any client who shall come to us, we have no choice as to which client we are supposed to represent. It is the client who chooses us. And therefore, if we represent a particular client who is, undis who is perceived as undesirable client, it's not our fault. That is what we are called for. The Chief Justice must make sure that this place is completely out of bound for the untried police. They cannot come to remove us from the courts. It's a very sad uh, day for this nation. As officers of the court, our work is basically to uphold and respect the rule of law. From the first instance, our client was abducted. We don't call that an arrest because Babu Wino was not informed why he was being arrested at the point of arrest. He was ferried and taken all the way to Mwea in Kirinyaga County, very far, held in Comunicado. We were unable to reach out to him. Had he not written a note on a tissue paper, we wouldn't know where our client is. We've gone through different police stations trying to find out what our client has done. The Constitution of Kenya 2010 protects individuals. An accused person has a right under the law. So if someone is arrested, you're supposed to inform that person, allow that person to see their counsels, and present that person to court. Babo Wino was held in Comunicado. We first saw him as his advocates yesterday at two when he was presented to Miliman. And again, it took, as you are aware, members of the press, it took us the whole night to process this. The court gave directions that uh, the honorable member be taken to hospital. Still, the court issued that directive, but it was not seen to it. Instead, our client was hounded and taken to Kilelesho police station. And at 1 p.m., him together with the rest, there were thugs of 30 goods brought. And they actually, 1 a.m., and they actually beat up the accused persons. So the question is, where are we safe? If at the police station where an accused person is put, you're being attacked. If at the courts, we have anti-riot police officers coming to remove him. us, and as we speak, I'm being informed that they've rearrested they him, re -arrested and they've Wino. refused to release us to be able to process bail as per the court directive. So we are asking this country, let us respect the rule of law. The 2010 constitution was a very, very good step for our country. Let us not degenerate to levels where we lose, we lose the essence of justice. Number important two. question, important yes, question, yes. counsel. You you are saying they have arrested Babu Wino. Yeah, arrested I believe that you had not uh, complete. Yes. I believe that you had not completed processing the bail. So yes. how have they arrested him? We have been chased. We, we we went to pay cash bail there, and then we have been chased from from there by until So without police. without paying cash bail, it means that Babu Wino had not yet no. been released. Have they? Re what was to happen is once the court has granted him the cash bail and bond terms. We go to the registry, mm -hmm. we process, we pay, then he's released. We have been chased from the done, registry by a riot. These gentlemen from the registry. I have the cash bail here. They have not been allowed to process the cash bail, but they have whisked away Babo Wino. While still in they their custody. Given because they not you, you can imagine, reason. somebody has been whisked, and Mr. Okachi is here, he has witnessed that. Somebody who was within the jurisdiction of the court, somebody which the court has admitted to bail, has been whisked away, even without processing the bill. You can imagine where we are degenerating to. Where is the Chief Justice in this country? Where is the Chief Justice? Where is Honorable Martha Koome? Why are you allowing this to happen? Why are you allowing the courts to be defiled by police officers and by the state? Why? I, where is Maina Jenga? Why has he not been brought to court? Who is holding him? Where is he? Why can't he be brought to court? What offense has he committed that the court cannot be able to address? I believe even the devil needs justice. Why should you rearrest somebody and whisk him away even before he's processed by the court? We saw Kachi has witnessed that. Then it means, counsel, we cannot even call that rearrest. That is sort of an abduction. It is an abduction. It is a, it's a series of abductions. I do, and I do not even think we advocates are safe. But we shall continue, we shall die on our feet and not on our, on our knees. Yeah. And, and in fact, the most important thing that you need to understand is that they are even now trying to prevent advocates in court mm. from executing their mandate. This is our place, this is our office, this is where we work. But cops are being allowed to come and intimidate even advocates in court. It is a very dark day and I think that's why we, these backstops are the foot, are the foot of Martha Coleman. 
because she's the one who is in charge and to ensure that these courts are there for everyone.